Hello everybody, this is Lisa Brown, Brown Girls Crafting. We're gonna make a cute little tree on this board that I bought from Dollar Tree yesterday. And I moved the hanger up to the top because I wanted to use it long ways instead of uh, horizontal. I went ahead and took a pick here that I had and I decided to um, take the greenery off and make it look like a Christmas tree. And even though it has a bare spot there, you never know when you're going to find a tree out in the, the woods. It's going to look really great because all trees look different. I went ahead and stapled that to the top of our, tree, our board there. And then I decided that I had a wood star sitting over on my table. And I got some of the antique gold metallic paint. And I went ahead and painted our little wooden star this really pretty color. We're just gonna take one coat and just paint the front of it. We don't have to paint the back or the sides, we're just gonna paint the top part of it. I decided after I got this paint on here, we're gonna take one of the little Dollar Tree blocks that you can buy and raise that up just a little bit to give it a little bit of depth and it looks like it's sitting on top of the tree because that little stem there wanted to, to stand out just a little bit more than I wanted to. So we're going to glue that down with a little bit of hot glue and then we're going to put our star down. And then I decided to take some of the little berries that came off of that pick that I was using. And I went ahead and just tore some of them off and they have a little white backing on them. So I went ahead and put that backing toward the end with the glue. You can see that little white area and we're just going to nestle it down inside our little tree there. I think this is going to turn out to be a really rustic looking um, Christmas ornament. I really like it. We're going to end up putting three big ones and one small little berry. And it just takes a little bit of glue. And I had to push my glue stick in just a little bit more because it wasn't uh, advancing my glue just like I needed it to. But we got it fixed. Now we're going to take that little small berry and put it up there at the top. And then I decided that I was going to put some more of that snow on it that we made up tonight. I really like this stuff. I can't wait to see how it dries. It's supposed to dry a very good consistency, so we'll see. And I got a little bit too much on my berries, but I thought, I think that'll be all right. It just looks like the snow is dripping off of them. Then I realized I didn't have a trunk, and so I found one of those pieces of sticks that I bought a few weeks ago. And I cut it in half, and I had to struggle there to cut that, that twig in half. It was pretty tough. I just put some hot glue on it, and I lifted up the bottom there, and we have us a nice little trunk now. And I clipped off these little flyaway pieces of our tree there just so it wasn't sticking out kind of weird and got off all the little pieces. But I hope you guys all like this video, and please watch it at least a minute to help my algorithm out. I'll see you guys all later today. Goodbye.